up, everybody! It's trial time! Oh my Woo! god! Oh my god! The bear is here! <laughs> oh, Gina's been replaced! I know, indeed. <laughs> hey, everyone! Welcome back to Danganronpa V3. Killing Harmony is the one! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trigger happy havoc, not goodbye despair. It's killing harmony. <laughs> it's a little confusing because we are in trigger happy havocs. Uh, we are. Trials. The vibes are strained yeah. and twisted because it's been revealed that this is a war between hope and despair. Apparently, and uh, uh, Monokuma <laughs> dragged out the the <laughs> furnishing to match that uh, just auspicious moment. So we're in the class trial to figure out who died, whether it's Kaito or Ko Kokichi, and more importantly, who did a murder, uh, whether it's one of those two or somebody else. Um, we were told that everybody had to gather here for this class trial, but only a few of us did, which is unfortunate. So yep. we need to figure out uh, what exactly is going on, whether two people died, whether there's some trick up Monokuma's sleeve? We don't know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we were expecting either Kaito or Kokichi to show up because um, everybody was required, not, and neither of them did. Yeah, and ostensibly, whichever one showed up, the other one is the one that's dead. But yes. um, at least for the moment, that's not what happened. So Nope. Wouldn't it be wild if someone came back? Busting down the door during the middle of the class trial and be like, I'm here! Does that count? Uh, what do you mean? Well, because Monokuma made it very clear that whoever didn't ah. show up would be punished. Immediately. Immediately, so, that, yeah. And permanently. You know what? Good point. Um, I, I stand by, my theory is that both Kaito and Kokichi are dead. I think they are both dead. And... I think somehow the rest of the group is in on it in some way. I think it, I don't know how it can be all of those things. I, I love but... it and I'm here for it and I cannot wait to see how this class trial plays out. Oh man. Wanna dive in? Yeah, yeah. And and I, I also wanna reiterate that your point about the vibes being weird and they definitely are. Things feel off and strange. And I mean, even Shuichi said as much. Shuichi yeah. was like, something's wrong. I don't know what's going I don't know what it is, but something doesn't feel right. Exactly. All right. Well, we're going to start the class trial and we'll see where it leads us. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Let's do this thing. Oh, boy. Ahem. Now then. Let's begin with a basic explanation. <laughs> dead children. I love to see it. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just really sad, but also kind of very funny. <laughs> oh. Just the slow pullback I know. reveal. I see all the... like, anyway. Oh my god. <laughs> During the trial, you'll present your arguments for Question who mark. the culprit is and vote for who done it. Vote correctly, and only the blackened will be punished. But if you pick the wrong person. I'll punish everyone besides the blackened, and that person will graduate. Graduation is meaningless here. We already know that. Hmm. He said that. Don't need your rules anymore. <laughs> we'll find our own reasons to live, and we'll do whatever it takes to survive. Wow! An actual talking robot. I've never seen one of those before. <laughs> I've also never seen a mirror. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> Those two things aren't related. Yeah. Just two facts about me. I thought you should know. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> what happened to Kokichi? Why isn't he here? Aw, oh, don't make that face, killer. This case has some unique circumstances. Unique circumstances? Because for this murder, the victim's identity is completely unknown. Given these circumstances, I decided to start off this class trial while the victim is still anonymous. After all, it'd be a shame if I let such a rare opportunity go to waste. While the victim is still anonymous. Interesting. So start. that means the bear's assuming that we'll figure out who the victim is. I guess that's fair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is it possible? 
I thought everyone had to participate in the class trial. Don't worry. The person who's still alive is waiting behind the scenes for their cue. What? Ugh. Oh, okay. All right. Really? Okay. It's all part of the overall production. Anyway, let's get this trial moving. <sighs> okay. Really? Mm -hmm. Monokuma, what? I guess we have no choice but to start the trial under these conditions. Uh, okay, okay. All right, okay. What's there to even talk about? The Blacken is the mastermind, Kokichi. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of, too. It's too soon to decide anything for certain. We don't even know if Kaito was the victim. How long are you going to say that? The victim is Kaito. End of discussion. But we need to be absolutely sure if we don't positively identify the victim. The other person will never show themselves, right? Before we can identify a suspect, we need to determine who the victim is. Why are we even talking about something so obvious? What a pain. Everyone thinks that Kaito is the victim, but I have my doubts. There's a chance Kaito is still alive. If we keep discussing the case, I'm sure we'll see the truth. Okay. Well, we have a very uncooperative group here. Yeah, I don't like that. No. Monica file five, hydraulic press, Kaito's coat, Kokichi's clothes. Hold on. It's uh, probably Kokichi's clothes, just because I don't think everyone here knows about that. Yeah. Okay. Let's let it go. Kaito was taken prisoner by Kokichi. So he could have killed him whenever he wanted. And the hydraulic press had his clothes inside. Kokichi can't be the victim because there's no evidence for it. So the victim must be Kaito. I'm assuming it's Kokichi's clothes on no evidence. Yeah. Again, mostly because I don't think everyone else knows about that. Exactly. And there's like... If only mages could cast revive spells. That was really cute. Uh... Yeah, because it has, and it has like two puncture wounds in it mm -hmm. too, so yeah. There's no evidence that allows us to confirm the victim or the survivor. It's too early to declare who the victim is. The victim has to be Kaito. Yeah, I think we have to get to that point. Let's try that. Let's close the time, yeah. victim because there's no evidence for it. Oh, god damn it. So the victim must be Kaito. <laughs> Jeez. Sorry. <laughs> it begins. <laughs> it's oh. just like it's like whatever the opposite of threading a needle is. <laughs> just shotgunning it. <laughs> well, it's like if you really wanted a rope to be outside of a needle's hole and somehow it ended up in the, in the hole of a needle. Right? Like, yeah, there you go. Uh, yeah, yeah. Right. Did I get the V spot? Whatever. <laughs> I think so. I Did think you? I have blinked. evidence that uh. points to Kokichi being the victim. I found this in the hangar. Yeah. yeah. Is that Kokichi's coat? Yes. And look here. There are blood stains on the sleeve. And the back. That would indicate that Kokichi suffered an external injury, correct? Kokichi was injured? The fact that these were flushed down the toilet implies that they are evidence of a crime. What about it? Kaito's clothes were in the hydraulic press. As long as we have that evidence, there's no doubt that Kaito was the one murdered. Y yeah, that's right. It's one of those irrefutable evidence thingies. No, oh, guys, you could take clothes off and put them on other people. <laughs> I just feel like <laughs> that's like, such a stunned expression. Yeah, it's just like, wow, <laughs> guys. <laughs> Ever since she found the body in the hangar, Magi's insisted that it's Kaito's. Yeah. It's like in in 
instantly trying to say that Kaito is dead, it feels like maybe she's trying to cover for an alive Kaito in some way. I don't know how or why. Hmm. But why is that? I thought we had an understanding. I thought she'd want to believe Kaito is still alive. Either way, it seems Maki is hung up on Kaito's clothes. In that case, I need to demonstrate the flaw in relying on that evidence. If I do that, I think she'll realize there's a chance that Kaito is alive. Actually, there's something bothering me about the clothes found in the hydraulic press. Yeah? What about them? There's something peculiar about those clothes. Um, <clears throat> the the sleeve of the jacket or the blood stain on it? Could be both of these. Probably the sleeve on the jacket. I'm gonna try that. That's it. Yeah. There you go. Because it's got the hole in it. Why was only the sleeve sticking out of the hydraulic press? Mm, right, and you didn't see the rest of it. Or like an arm. Yeah. Yeah. If right. Kaito had been crushed by the press. The sleeve shouldn't have been empty. Although Kaito only wears one arm and, and yeah, one sleeve. Yeah, he actually doesn't so. even wear his arm in that sleeve. It's usually... Unless that's... That's the one that he keeps off. Depending... Only... It, it depends on the orientation of, of the body. I guess that's true. Yeah. Yeah. It oh, yeah. It depends on which side, which sleeve that is. Is that the left or the right Yeah, sleeve? because if he's on his back, he should have had an arm in that sleeve. Right. If he's on his stomach... It then would have it, been empty. It would have been empty. Yeah, yeah. so it just depends on... Mm -hmm. Yeah. There should have been an arm inside the sleeve as well. So the fact that we found an empty sleeve should... Shall I kill that logic? Hey, Maki. Oh. You're dumber than I thought if I have to go out of my way to explain it to you. If you can't even see that, then be quiet. Otherwise, you're just annoying me. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Conflict. Oh boy. What piece of evidence is it? One, two, all five. Hydraulic press, Kaito's coat, swipe pattern the in the blood. Uh, I don't know what the last one was. Oh. The, or, uh, well, let's see. It's blood stain in the bathroom. Okay. Small blood puddle in the middle of the hangar bathroom. Small blood stains were found leading uh, to the door out of the bathroom. What is Kaito's coat? Kaito's clothes. Um, is that just saying that okay. there's a hole in it? When the body was discovered, only the left... Okay, it's the left sleeve. That would have had an arm in it. That would have had an arm yep. in it, yeah. That's well, almost definitely what she's about to say. But. Yep. Only the left sleeve was sticking out of the hydraulic press. A single small hole can be seen where the sleeve stick out. It's sticking out. Okay. Um, it's probably sticking gonna out be of the hydraulic Oh shit, press. I need to do my job. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I move my I just, sword? What's, what's happening? What's happening? <laughs> what? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Did you see that shit? Wait, did you see that? <laughs> I mean, I saw it, but I don't understand it. What? It was like locking in place. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Maki, you look even more murderous than usual. Okay. I need to do well with this debate, or I think she's actually going to kill me. The coat sleeve sticking out of the hydraulic press. It's rather telling. It couldn't have been anyone else. But Kaito. Yes. Thank you. If you can't see that... Ah, shit. Then you weren't looking hard enough. That's not what we're arguing. hard enough. What do you mean? Mm -hmm. He always dressed himself in a rather odd manner. Oh, he never put his arms through his coat sleeves. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's going to be Kaito's so coat. When the hydraulic Fuck. press crushed him. All that stuck out was his coat sleeve. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to get that one. If you understand the be quiet already. No, in fact, he's much weirder than that, Otherwise, Maki. He yeah. wears one arm in one coat sleeve. Yeah. All right, sorry, I have to start over. Um, but... I wanted to He always make dressed sure. himself in a rather odd manner. Oh, I don't have to start over. No. Ah. Never his arms through his God, damn. Slice it. Okay. Oh, cut. Okay, okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. 
They were so angled that time. The, yes. They were hard to get. He never put his arm through his sleeve. Uh, through his right sleeve. But that was just his right arm. He wore his left sleeve normally. <laughs> what a weirdo. What a, a strange child. It's so funny that it was so distinct that it became an aspect of evidence in this trial. Indeed, I like, agree. <laughs> that is honestly hilarious to me. Like, it just... And the left sleeve was the one we found outside the press. Like, you would think it's just, like, a, a, a silly, quirky little character design thing. They're that, like, no, we're using this. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> no, this contribute. Yeah, it's like, it's like taking, again, I'm, like, referencing Mew again. It's like taking one of the, like, little rivets on Mew's outfit and being, actually, it got caught on a hook. And that's and how that's we know <laughs> it was her. <laughs> right? Yeah. So, I just, that's so yeah. interesting. <laughs> Knowing how Kaito wore his coat, that's awfully strange, isn't it? Yeah, there should be a exploded arm sticking out. Mm -hmm. Then maybe neither of his arms were through the sleeves. Okay. Huh? It's a possibility. In the end, your reasoning is full of holes. Stop getting in my way. Like that sleeve. I have to defeat Kokichi. Okay, Maki. Okay, Maki. Okay. Maki. What's really going on? I wish, like, we could have a conversation, but obviously we cannot because we're in the middle of a class trial. Well, she also opted lives. out of that early on. She was like, I'm not talking with you. Yep. And left. Yep. Yep. She sure did. <sighs> She's covering. She's covering in some way. It's gotta be. <sighs> Seems you've made up your mind about Kai that Kaito is definitely dead. But why would you do that? It's like Maki said, though. Kaito's gotta be the victim. Because if Kokichi, the mastermind, was dead, the killing game would be over. Yeah, that's true. Monokuma, hurry up and bring Kokichi here. We already know who the victim is. Huh? Already? You sure it's not too soon? We need the suspect present, now that he's the subject of our discussion. Gotcha. I guess I'll bring him out now. What? What? Hey, Mr. Suspect! That's your cue! Oh, what? Oh my god, what's happening? What is happening? Huh? What? <laughs> what is happening? What? Why is an exosol here? Haha, <laughs> whoops. Oh, hi. My bad. Seems like I gave you guys a scare, huh? What the fuck? What is happening? What is this? Are you in the. Are, have you been uploaded into the Exosol now, or are you piloting it? How is this happening? What's going on here? Well, we saw there's a cockpit. There is a, co there is a cockpit, yeah. Kaito? Also, yeah, I knew he wasn't dead. <laughs> there was a lot going on, so I just hid in an Exosol and kind of dozed off. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's why I'm so late. Anyway, what's going on, guys? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, sure. You fell asleep in the exosol. <laughs> what? No, you did not. Come on. Come on. What's going on? Hold on. Sorry. Then the one that died wasn't Kaito. Stupid. That was just a lie. What's happening? I'm going to quit. <laughs> <laughs> Allison fully pushing the mic away. And just like, I'm done. I'm out. Guys, what's going on? What's happening right now? I'm... <laughs> you guys thought I died? <laughs> I would never! No way! Kokichi? I'm gonna live till I die. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh instead of cry. <laughs> <laughs> Commitment. <laughs> Indeed, wow. committing to a, a bit. <laughs> Who are you? Oh. I thought 
thought as much. Your appearance right now is fit for a lowly asshole like you. <laughs> You're making me blush. You're getting so angry over me. <laughs> Y'all. Uh... <laughs> What's happening? I'm I'm <laughs> having just such a great time <laughs> with this. Just like the the meltdown here. Yeah. Oh my god. That's right, Cracker Jack. Seriously, how old are you? <laughs> Then why are you hiding in there? Show yourself. Oh, this is more for self-defense. Little Miss Cranky Pants would kill me if I showed myself. Also, why Doesn't... were you talking as Kaito a moment ago? Yeah, why were you doing that? Also, oh, you sound kind of everything. It's all off. Everything's off. What's happening? Yeah, what? No. I understand how you guys must feel. You can't believe it because I'm like this, right? Like he's he's speaking weird. Ugh. <laughs> That's what I thought. In that case, I brought evidence. Evidence? Maybe it's just because we can't see him. I don't know. This is all. I don't like. Uh, no. Uh. 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 U
Dancing exosol yeah. riff. <laughs> Hello, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh. By the way, yeah. I'd like to add that this footage has not been doctored in any way. Mm hmm. This video camera only has the basic functions. Mm hmm. Just the play, record, and pause button so you can't edit after filming it. And of course, I didn't upload it to a computer to edit it either. Right, Monokuma? <laughs> mm. Uh huh. Oh, you can talk. Your answer is necessary for a fair discussion. I see. If it's necessary for a fair discussion, then I will answer. No trace of that footage was found on any of the computers inside the Academy. It's okay. See, if it wasn't connected to any computer, then editing the footage would be impossible. Which means this footage is 100% real. If that's the case, then it would seem our suspicions can be lifted. The body we found inside the hangar, crushed in the hydraulic press, is definitely Kaito. Oh, this is a new truth bullet that's been added. Mm -hmm. Mid-trial. Okay, so you can see all of him, yep. but you can't see all of the hydraulic press. I don't know. Just saying. Okay, interesting. Murder video has been recorded as a truth bullet. Okay. I mean, I think there's a broader question of why the murderer would show a video of their murder. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yes. What, what do they have to gain? Uh-huh. Unless Kokichi showing it to us, if, if this is Kokichi, isn't the murderer. You know? But then Kokichi would be dying what do you mean it's like so so if kokichi is showing the murder video if kokichi is the murderer and the video shows their murder and we vote kokichi as the murderer then they get executed like right kokichi gets executed okay then if kokichi isn't the murderer shows the video we vote kokichi as the murderer they're not the murderer everybody the black and goes free kokichi gets executed oh i see okay okay there's no like he dies either way yeah oh whether he's innocent or not this is a bold move fascinating so, yeah. okay wow all right was that was that really him poor kaito I can't believe he died such a horrible death. He died with his guts and his brain splattered all over that machine. Stop it! Now I'm starting to not feel well. That's probably because I used my magic to transfer all my barf over to you. Uh-huh. I know that's a joke, but the thought of it... <laughs> Why? Why was Kaito killed? Kokichi had no reason to kill Kaito. He had just told us all that. Uh, he had just told us all that he was the mastermind, that the killing game was over. So what would he gain by killing Kaito? <laughs> it looks like you finally believe that I'm the one in this exosol. Yes. With that, we can definitively say that the culprit is... No! Open the fucking cockpit! They can't. Yeah. I, why not? Oh, I guess because... Nobody can. Because Kokichi has the controller for it. Yeah, I guess that's true. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Interesting. Okay. Huh? Why? Huh? <laughs> you filmed the moment the victim died, which means you were present at the scene. As the person who filmed this footage, you're the only one who could be the culprit. But if the culprit shot the video, why would they go out of their way to show it? Yeah, like you said. Oh man, you got me! Yeah, I'm the culprit. What? Jeez, I totally dug my own grave. 
here's the truth. I decided to participate in this trial in an exosol after I killed Kaito. Of course, it was mostly to make the victim unknown. To jazz up this trial! I took that footage for proof so I could reveal it after you guys get the correct answer. But <laughs> I totally spaced out. I wasn't supposed to show it right away. So does that mean you admit to the crime? Oh, man. I dug my own grave again? <laughs> the way you're saying it. <laughs> oh, man. I dug my own grave again. Did I, did I do that? I know. <laughs> like it's really good. <laughs> Great performance. Well, I don't think you guys will believe any of the excuses I make now. So, I give up. You're giving up? Does that mean it's been decided? Is it okay that this trial was so short? That's fine. We knew from the very start that Kokichi was the killer. But before we vote, I want to say something to Kokichi. You may be the mastermind, but I won't let you escape after you violated the rules. That would desecrate the killing game Junko and Oshima created, right? Your beloved Junko and Oshima. Mm, pulling the Junko card. Junko? Whatever. It's voting time now. Let's go before Kokichi changes his... No, hold on a second. This isn't right. The culprit comes in, confesses to the crime, and the trial ends? That's not how this goes. Sorry, Allison's been making a face. I'm so fucked up right now with this. Sorry. I don't even know if I have anything to say yet because I'm still thinking about it. Okay. Except that... That flashback... The thing that immediately came to my mind is that we all assumed that Kokichi gave us that last flashback light to show us everything about the history of Hope's Peak Academy, the remnants of despair, Junko and Oshima, everything like that, and that it was all connected. We all assumed that it was Kokichi. Um, what if it wasn't? What if it wasn't Kokichi? And he's just not a remnant of despair. And he has no idea. Or it's possible. I mean, I don't know how. The two people that weren't present for the flashback light were Kaito and Kokichi. I know. Um, yeah. But so maybe he just also hasn't used that flashback light yet? I don't know. But he's claiming that he's the mastermind. But he's never said remnants of despair. He's just said the organization that was trying to stop the gopher project. Right? Mm -hmm. I don't know. This is all this is all really weird. This is all really, really weird. I'm glad that Shuichi's stepping in, though. Thank you. That doesn't sound like the kind of game Kokichi or Monokuma or Junko would play. Mm. What if the Mastermind got tired of it? The remnants of despair were like that. Mm. No, if they were tired of it, they wouldn't have put all that effort into the video. There would have been no need for this class trial in the first place. Something's not right. We need to get a better feel for this situation. I think Kokichi has some sort of plan. He's trying to trap us. Trap us? Are you saying Kokichi isn't the culprit? Then are you suggesting one of us is the culprit? What? If it's not Kokichi, then the culprit must be one of us. That's what I said when we went down into this. One of us? That's not possible! No, I didn't say that. I was just saying it's dangerous to trust Kokichi. <laughs> Shuichi is so distrusting. But it's exactly like Shuichi said. I'm actually not the culprit. Seriously? What? But that contradicts what you said previously. Yep, that was a lie. Sorry. 
I lied again. The real culprit of this case is super bad at hiding themselves, so I thought I could help. I pretended to be the culprit by using the footage! It made the game more interesting, too. Uh, are you serious? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I love how we've both gone quiet, because it's like, what do you even... What do you even say? What do I do with this? <laughs> what do you do with any of this? I've just got to let it kind of play yeah, out. Yeah, I agree. We're, I think we're doing the right thing here. It's yeah. like you just kind of have to like give it a moment. But I really wish you could see my face. Yeah. Because I think I'm going on a journey. <laughs> I wish I could see my face. Like. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. It's fine. Because Kokichi is the culprit. Everybody shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> like, I do think that's the right take. Yeah. Like, can we, okay, wait, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Where just, were you last night? Yeah. <laughs> can we just, like, treat this like a trial? No. And everybody just stop talking right now. Uh. Like, come on. Like, please. <laughs> <laughs> Can't, like, stop fucking accusing someone of accusing that ever someone else in the group could have done it whatever the fuck like yeah let's just work through this okay because this this is absolute like chaos mm -hmm. right now no we're making no progress this, i i i i don't know <laughs> <laughs> oh my god he killed kaito no matter how much he deceives us, it won't change our minds. Also, nobody's fucking questioning this Exus all situation here either. Like, it's- Oh, you know, just for laughs and giggles. It's so, I- You know that Kokichi. Oh, I want to bite something. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> just- <sighs> I need a drink of water. <laughs> 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 oh, I love this trial. I'm so upset. This case is buck wild. What is happening? The footage shows he did it. Kokichi has to be the only option. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just the, the fucking the video camera that just comes in with the steel chair. I like, mean, it, it does it does show Kaito being crushed under a, a hydraulic. I know. Press. I know, but uh, what, it's just like, here you go. Like, what? Yeah, no, it's it's weird. I agree. Ugh, it's very I, strange. It's very weird. It's I very roll, strange. I roll my eyes at that. So it just, uh, I know, Corey. That's right? right? <laughs> Corey was making a face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the only option. Is that really true? Are we just going to leave it at that? And it's like, okay, it's also times like this where I wish Shuichi would... I mean, he does say the stuff. Like he does say things. Yeah, he's been he's been the only one pushing back this whole time. I just I, I think he doesn't want to just more, throw. But... It, it seems like he's trying not to to throw this all on Maki. That's fair. It's a delicate situation Maki's too. Maki's his friend. Yeah. Sort of. <laughs> Sometimes. Yeah. Uh, and it's a delicate situation. If he pushes too hard, he could look suspicious. Yeah. Like, uh, I, I get it. I get it. Um, the. I'm just, mm hmm yeah, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, Lord. Non-stop debate, let's do this thing. Corey, do you think you can come over here? <laughs> Corey, do you think you can get out of the way? <laughs> Hydraulic press, safety function, blood stain in There's the bathroom. No doubt that cocaine. It's murder video and uh, crossbow. Murder video and crossbow, those are the last ones? Yes. Okay. He's the culprit. You all saw that footage from earlier, right? I this is a lie one. Mm-hmm. Horrible video. Whoever committed that crime was with Kaito in the hangar. Which just leaves Kokichi then. Then the culprit is. That was fast. Kokichi Oma, the mastermind of this entire killing game. And Kaito's killer. I think that might be a new sprite. I um, think so. Kokichi oh. killed Kaito with the hydraulic press. That's the consensus right now. It was Kokichi in the hangar with the hydraulic press. Probably. <laughs> I think I can guess what the lie is here. Although I'm not saying we should do it. My guess is that it's something involving the Monokuma file and the how he died and lying about it. I'm not saying we should go that route, but I'm just guessing that. 
because that's a really weird, like, he was killed. I don't know. Yeah. I'm not saying we should lie. I'm just saying I, oh, I, I think I can guess the lie. I actually weirdly want to lie in this one. Want to try if that? Can. Yeah. Um, so. I don't know that for sure. I want to be clear. I, I, yeah. So you're saying it's the hydraulic, uh, back up, back up. You're saying the lie is It's like, that the, uh, uh, Himiko has a like, and that's how Kaito was killed. And I think we, we lie about the Monokuma file or something like that. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I kind of like that theory. Um, Again, I, I don't know that, I, but that if I had to like take a stab in that, sorry, I said that with more confidence than like I actually feel. Let me look at Monokuma file five. Cause that's it's just nothing. I mean, you're right. It's just that the victim was crushed by a hydraulic press. Their remains cannot be identified. Mm -hmm. um, so, I mean, uh, yeah, uh, we could try that. I, 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 I don't see how it's crossbow. I don't see it's how. It's also possible that we could use the Monokuma file on that one and not lie. I don't know. True. Okay. Hydraulic press's controls are, uh, see, my mind was going towards the safety function. Okay. Um, that's probably, I think that's probably right. Yeah, that. That you shouldn't be able to kill somebody with the hydraulic yeah, press. Yes, you should, the, the hydraulic press shouldn't even be an issue. Yeah, so hydraulic oh. press and then counter that with no, that's wrong, there's a safety function. I think that's fair. Yeah. yeah. Let's do that. Um, there's no doubt that Tokichi is think the culprit. That's, that's not the lie, obviously. We all saw no. that footage but. from earlier, right? Kaito got crushed to death. That's the one I think would be the Monokuma video. funnel. Yeah. Whoever committed that crime, was with Kaito in the hangar. I don't think it's that. Which it's... just leaves Kokichi then. It's not that. Um, the culprit is. No, I think it was crushed to death. Oh, I guess it was crushed to death. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just making sure there wasn't another. Uh, no, that's fair. There's no doubt that Kokichi is the culprit. Frustrating. We all saw that footage. Kaito got crushed to death. Got it. Yep. That's all right. Yep. 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 <gasps> well, oh, you know what? I know what this means. I know what this means. I know what this means. Make it impossible to kill Kaito with the press. He's, he's already dead. If they put him on the press and it doesn't detect something living, you can crush the body still if he's already dead on the press. So he was already dead. If Kaito was, if his body was crushed by the press, if the video that we saw is is true and actual footage of something that happened. Last night, whatever, here in the academy, you know what I mean? Like, if if that was for realsies Kaito's body, then it was his body. He wasn't alive. It's possible. Um, it's definitely possible. I just need some, this is what I mean by I want to bite something. I, I need know. Some, I, I, need to, uh, I need to get a hold of something. I, I, I know. Because <laughs> I feel like- You need something to hold on to. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like anything I had is is like, ah! Uh, like slipping through my fingers. I, yep. It feels like like jello. It, yes, it's it's a it's a foundation of sand. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> yes. A safety function. Yes, it was written on the safety precautions. The hydraulic press will automatically stop if its infrared sensor detects a living organism. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So the hydraulic press won't move at all if there's a living person under it. So they're gonna be like, yeah, it could have crushed. It couldn't have crushed him, but then we have to get to the point where it's like, well, it probably could have crushed him because he wasn't alive. Which is why it couldn't have been used to kill Kaito. It couldn't have been used to kill Kaito. Yeah, that that's the main thing. Yes. Yeah, I I agree. I think that's also an interesting point. But what we're arguing right now is is this was not the murder weapon. Correct. Yep. Correct. We gotta we gotta chip away at this one. Oh boy. Which means it's more likely that Kaito was crushed after being killed by some other means. Thank you, Kibo. He's got a big old puncture wound in his arm. Mm -hmm. So what we saw in that video, he was already dead by then? Why was his coat But you could disable this. the infrared sensor of the safety function with an electrobomb. No, I don't think Kokichi would use an electrobomb for that purpose. It would have taken down the hangar's alarm system and the Exosol's remote control. Mm-hmm. It would have put Kokichi at a significant disadvantage. But you can't be too sure I wouldn't do that. I'm the type who would do anything for fun. Also, we don't have any evidence of a different murder method other than the hydraulic pro- 
No, we do. I have a plausible theory for the murder. What? Yes, there's a clue that suggests the victim was killed before the crush, mm -hmm. being crushed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I found it somewhere around the hydraulic press. Right, because there's the because the because there was the bloodstained drag yes. all the way to the press. Like, uh, what am I looking for here? Uh, I mean, do you want to do the swipe pattern bloodstain? Uh, either the swipe pattern or this or um or the three arrows. Oh, there's so many things. There's yeah. so many things. You said somewhere near the hydraulic press, so maybe it's the swipe blood stain. I'll, I'll go yeah. with that. That's where my mind went this first. Yep. Yeah, okay. Admittedly, Maki didn't investigate. There it's was a swipe noting. pattern blood stain in the hangar, suggesting a body was dragged. Yep. The yep, blood yep, stain yep. goes from the bathroom all the way to the press. Oh, that was the restroom where Kaito was being held, wasn't it? Blood stains were also found inside the bathroom. That can't be coincidence. So Kaito was killed in the restroom, then dragged to the press and crushed? If the blood stain even was Kaito's. What? We only guessed that Kaito was killed in the bathroom. Since his body was crushed, we'll never know if Kaito died some other way. We might not be able to examine the body, but we do have evidence that suggests uh, suggests a cause of death. Uh, I guess the the yeah, puncture wounds. So. Yeah. There. Yeah. The small hole on the sleeve of Kaito's coat is the key to his cause of death. It's a small hole. No, there is no way that hole's got anything to do with the weapon. Hmm. I'll hit you with my everything you buy will go on sale the next day, curse. Oh, that's a bad one, Himiko. Not if the world is done. What? You know what? Fair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I play my reverse Uno. There are no stores left. <laughs> Except for the, the Academy store, and that's not real. You're right, but that's Gachapon, <laughs> so, <Yeah>. you know. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah, Himiko, you- And there are no sales. No, you, Himiko, you brought the weapon in. Himiko, what's wrong? Why are you freaking out all of a sudden? She brought the weapon in. Um, I'm not freaking out. I'm just saying it's impossible for the weapon to be that small. It's really <laughs> not. It's really not. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not impossible. I can show you. The weapon that left that small hole in Kaito's sleeve. Uh, it is the three arrows. Yeah. yeah. What? The arrows in the bathroom. That's not the right one. I guess one. it's a crossbow. Fine. What can you do with just an arrow? Are you saying they stabbed him with it? <sighs> That's whatever. dumb, but whatever. That's <laughs> dumb. It's just a crossbow. It's a crossbow. This is it! Whatever. That's, that's I guess the stupid. arrows are gonna come into play for a different- I know, the yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, in the bathroom. I get it, I understand. I jumped the gun. <laughs> I jumped the crossbow. <laughs> a crossbow arrow would certainly leave a hole that small. You mean like these arrows? <laughs> like these? The ones covered in blood? <laughs> the was shot with that crossbow? Ah. Uh. If so, that crossbow just might be the actual murder weapon used to kill Kaito. I see. It's so surprising that a crossbow is the murder weapon. Aha, uh -huh, Himiko. Seriously, Himiko, what's wrong? She probably needs to pee. Anyway, about Kaito getting shot. Mm. If that was his cause of death, then I wonder who shot him with the crossbow. Well, I already know. But I won't tell you! He's just playing with us. Then let's show him that playtime is over. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, all right. Let's show him that the students of Hope's Peak Academy will never submit to despair. I want him to be like, what are you talking about? 
Hope? Despair? Everything is weird, and I want to throw my controller. <laughs> <laughs> Bloodstained in the bathroom, crossbow, three arrows, bathroom I window. Who shot Kaito with the crossbow. Okay. What a mystery, right, guys? Who else but you could have done it? The shot three would arrows. need to be fired from inside the hangar to hit Kaito. Oh, that's a wild one. We couldn't Fuck. go in the hangar. The alarm system and electric barrier were in the way. Barrier, 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 barrier. We couldn't Fuck go that. In <laughs> and Kokichi had been in there, then he must be the one. I see. So I'm the culprit. I mean, I guess there's the bathroom window. Mm hmm. Kaito would have been in there, but the murder weapon was a crossbow. Knowing that, we should be able to visualize the murder. I wonder who shot Kaito with the crossbow. What are the other what ones? What a mystery, right, guys? Hanger front shutter, who blood stain. Else you could have done it. It's, the shot would need to be fired. Be bathroom window. From inside the. Oh wait, I can just do this. Yep. That's not much red text in the yeah. way. I was like, Get out of the way! And then <laughs> this is white, evil white text. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> not real. Even without going in the hangar, it was possible to land a shot with a crossbow. There was a window in the bathroom of the hangar. That's like, like a trick shot. How would you even do that? Maybe I guess it on the outside. To get yeah. In, but you could have shot through the window. I guess you could have gotten up to the window and stuck the crossbow in and ching, yeah. and like took taking a shot that way. What the fuck? Then what was? Okay. Fascinating. Okay. And okay. That Kaito Himiko. Fine to the bathroom. Here we go. What the fuck? So if they shot Kaito through the window, they could have killed him in the hangar. Which means the murder suspect list grows to six people, including me! <laughs> what did you say? But put plainly, that means... It seems Shuichi wants to make one of us the culprit. Is that it? Is that what a detective does? Girl, girl, what are you doing? Okay, oh my God. Huh? <sighs> okay, 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 okay. Do detectives always accuse people, even when they're friends? It seems like it. You suspected Kaito in the previous class trial too. Oh my God. Maki, I've suspected Kaito since the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> you can't even comprehend how much we've suspected Kaito. <laughs> Hell, he might have still done it. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> oh, this time you're like, nah. <laughs> what? But you know? No, I don't know. <laughs> no, I know. I'm just kidding. I just think it's really funny. That's all. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Took to the fifth class trial for you to be like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't know. <laughs> we watch his dead we watch his body get crushed. I don't know. <laughs> well, like, oh well. I get, you know. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> well Gush Dern. <laughs> Gush Dern it. <laughs> You're always suspicious of your friends. She's calling us a bad friend. What's wrong, Maki? You seem like you're kind of on edge. And Tsumugi's just calling it how she sees yeah. it this whole time, too. <laughs> that's, that's her job. <laughs> of course I am. She's like a live commentator. <laughs> <laughs> Himiko, you seem really upset. What's wrong right yeah. now? <laughs> Maki, you're acting really strange. Yeah. What are you doing? Thanks, thanks, Smoogie. Hey, Kokichi, are you a person? <laughs> <laughs> like... <sighs> oh... When we said we would defeat the remnants of despair, someone got in our way. No, you don't understand. I'm not trying to... It doesn't matter how much you get in my way. I will absolutely defeat Kokichi. See, now that she's saying that... Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't want to say that Magi did it as a way to bring down Kokichi, but that wouldn't make any sense. Because then, because, because I don't know, she gets out, 
What does that do? Anyway, <laughs> I don't know. I won't let despair escape. I won't let it win. Now, now, let's stop this boring fight and continue on with the not so boring trial. Does he? Ah! <laughs> It's she, it, the the Exosol Kukichi's have been bothering me a lot. <laughs> like I don't like it. It's uh, yes. It's not. Is it? Is it me? Or is it just like he's just not right? Like <laughs> <laughs> there's just something about him. It's just not right. Other than the fact that there's an Exosol standing you here, you know, right casual. Now. Like uh, ah. So we all agree that the murder could be done by anyone and not just me, right? It could also just be that I don't have the visualization for Kokichi there anymore. And, and it's, it's throwing you really off. really throwing me off. Uh, because now I'm hyper aware of all of the words that he's saying. Mm -hmm. And like trying to pick apart his intonation. and But also, there have been multiple things he said where, where he's like like tonality wise have been very suspicious. So I'm just gonna stop talking and keep going. Go ahead. No, I, I like getting a read on where you're at. I know. Especially because like this trial is a lot of like, mm, just flattening yourself back against yes. the back of the couch and just being like, huh. Okay. Like I feel like, right. Yes. So yes. I, I like knowing where you're at. I feel like I'm being physically pinned to the couch right now. <laughs> like I don't know how to describe yeah, it. Yeah, I, I agree. Oh my god. I, I feel it. I'm right there with you. <laughs> Can I know what's going on? <laughs> I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> Neither did I. Really, Himiko? What's the matter? You've been weird since we mentioned small holes. What? Are you after my small hole too? Oh my god. <laughs> See? Now that's definitely weird. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it this way. Just because the culprit could be anyone, not everyone is a suspect. We can pretty much narrow it down to anyone who knew about the crossbow. Okay. Yeah, which I guess would be... Himiko and Kaito and Maki and Shuichi. Yeah, but Himiko's a weird one because she wasn't there for the intimate crossbow building exercise. Yeah, she wasn't. So um, that's it. But we know she was holding a crossbow. Mm -hmm. So yeah, yeah. I never knew about any crossbows. Again, unless she was just told to take that bag to Kaito and she didn't know what it was. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I think I think this might be a little a little bait and switch situation, you know, where she's mm -hmm. like she's acting really weird and and uh you know, suspicious because she learned after the fact that the bag that she brought to the scene of the crime is the murder weapon or something like that. I don't know. I don't know. Or maybe she did it. In other words, <laughs> I'm not suspicious. There's no way you can consider me. It does concern me that Himiko went to the hangar last night. Aye. Thank you, Kibo. Thank you, Kibo. <laughs> yeah. Well, really? You went to the hangar, Himiko? Yes, she did. I definitely saw her. You, you were watching me? It's awfully suspicious that you went to the hangar last night. Okay, then the culprit is Himiko. Wait! Don't say it's me! Maki's more suspicious than I am! We're too early in this trial to call it. Well, or also, Hibiko. it's it's now everybody's starting to point, point fingers. This is new. This yep. is new. Yep, yep, yep. We've finally broken past the Kokichi wall and people are, are slinging, sl finger slinging. Yep, the finger slinging. <laughs> <laughs> what? Th that crossbow came from your research lab, right? You could have gotten that crossbow whenever you wanted! Anyone could have gone to her research lab, though. She's not the only suspect. I don't know about that. She's definitely the most suspicious. Even if you make that scary face at me, I'm not gonna get scared. Because if you start panicking, then we'll know that you're the culprit. one! Maki too! They're both the culprits! 
Why am I a suspect? Anyone could have entered my research oh, lab. Oh god, it's the shouting one, probably. I, uh, <laughs> I'll admit that I'm suspicious. <laughs> okay, maybe I am the culprit. Again, <laughs> everybody shut the fuck up! <laughs> that's again! That's Axel Kokichi's not gonna let us do that, No, <laughs> no. But that's the, that's the whole takeaway of this trial so far, is everybody shut the fuck up! Yeah. And let's just work through this. Maybe I'm the culprit! I'm the culprit. <laughs> Great, <Jesus>. thanks, y'all. <laughs> oh, really, really efficient problem solving I here. Hate this I one. actually love, I love that they're behaving like irrational. Yeah, I, I think it's, it's great. Pretty good. Oh God! Oh, what are my, what are my things? Here? I don't know. Small suspicious bottle. Hebo's account. Exosol protecting Monokuma. Uh, uh, poison. Yeah. Which is the the strike nine? Strike nine. Sorry. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's coming. Patches electric lock. A small empty bottle. Then who actually the number one suspect? Empty-handed Kiba's account. Oh oh yeah. yeah. God damn it. Yeah yeah you're right. Um. Yeah. Because she's like, I went there empty-handed. And, and I left empty-handed. Yeah. So we, we want the went there, because we know she went there with something. Yep. What do you Did mean not come the magic. Oh my god. A good magic <laughs> this is just nonsense. <laughs> yeah, there it is. And then... Nice. No, you didn't. I heard it. I heard that shit. Back me up on this, Kibo. You said that you went to the hangar empty-handed. But that's a lie, isn't it? What are you talking about? It's wee, wee, wee. not a lie. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. weird sound that effects. Was, are. You had the little lie alarm above yeah. your head. <laughs> but Kibo saw you. He said you were headed toward the hangar, carrying a large black bag. Yes. Himiko was definitely carrying a large black bag. Kiba, how did you get into whatever vantage point that is? Like, was, where even is that? That's a great question. Yeah. Like, <laughs> what? He said he was in his lab. Is his lab next to no, uh, the he, hangars? He went in. Remember, this was when he was going in to negotiate with Kokichi and then like while he was looking around. Yeah, he did say that. But then he said at some point he was like, I was in my lab planning to say planning to oh, I guess see so. what I was going to tell that's Kokichi. Not, I don't think that's the angle of it, whatever. It doesn't matter. I know, but it's, uh, <laughs> yeah. so that's what You're I right, assumed that's fair. it was supposed to be his lab, but. And that is tall. Like it, it's still, I don't know. It's fine. It's, it is, it is a um, concise image for puzzle solving. So sure. it's fine. Yeah. It's like he has height and I guess yep. she was outside walking over into the hangar yep. and his lab is right next door. All right, I'll, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, it's fine. I'll allow it. <laughs> no, no, that was probably Smoogie cosplaying as me. She can't Himiko, do that. We established Cospox. this in chapter one. <laughs> Come on, she would say that. She too. would say she that. Said, we established that in chapter one. <laughs> and everybody just keeps on going. Yeah. Can't cosplay as someone unless they're a fictional character. Yeah. Himiko, this is the bag you were carrying, isn't it? That's the crossbow case. There's no mistake. That is the bag I saw Himiko carry. <laughs> what? Hold on. Himiko went to the hangar with a crossbow? <laughs> Did you know it was a crossbow? Uh-oh. Well, it's decided then. I believe you. Himiko is totally telling the truth. Not Just stop you. talking. If you believe me, it makes me look like I'm lying. <laughs> that is true. Yeah. But can we really trust Himiko here? She was acting very suspiciously. Okay. Good time. What are we working with here? We have crossbow, three arrows, small empty bottle, exosol protecting on a human poison. Okay. Weird. Yeah, I totally agree. Not sure which one this gun is. Uh-uh. I only carried the case. 
Yep, yep, that's true too. And I didn't even use the crossbow. Mm-hmm, another true statement. <laughs> and that's all. I didn't do anything else in the hangar. 100% exact, Amundo. Why does this all sound so fishy? <laughs> it's true he won't shut up though <laughs> to hit kaito with the crossbow you'd have to be fairly good with it mm. could himiko have done this that's the question I'm not the culprit. wait can we lie now yeah i, told yeah, I guess so it changed the yeah i thought changed. earlier it started with the with the the non-lie one but it yeah i guess it's a lie one yeah, I, I noticed that too. Yeah, because when it started up, I was like, huh, no it's been why? a while since we've heard not, yeah, huh. I, I was thinking it's going to be an agree. I don't think you can lie on agrees. Can you? Can you lie on agrees? I kind of want to try. Because it's multiple agrees and then there's one yellow. There's one, Everything yeah. Everything else is an agree. Yes. I only carried the case. Carried the case. Yep, yep, that's true too. And I didn't even use the crossbow. Mm -hmm. What is the Another actual details on the crossbow? Uh, is it that it's hard to build? Let's see. Yeah, I also want to check three arrows. Disassembled crossbow from the Ultimate Assassin's Research Lab. It was stored in a large black case. It was complicated to assemble and would be difficult for anyone who wasn't taught how. Okay, so okay. that's probably the thing where it's like she didn't know how. And it's like, I agree, I agree. You, didn't, you didn't know how. I don't know what the lie would be. Um, it's, I... I I could be wrong about this. I I don't. Maybe it's not think a lie. You one. can lie on a and that's all. on a, an agree. So it would have to be on the yellow one. One hundred percent exact, Amundo. I don't know. Uh, Why does okay. this all sound so fishy? Ah, Get out of my head, Kokichi! Okay. Okay. This is so. Not oh. the culprit. I don't know why this track is throwing yeah. me yeah, off. Yeah, it, it is. Does, yeah. I can't yep, yep. agree with that. Two, two. And I didn't even use the crossbow. Shit. No, you B spot Woo! Woo! Oh, wow. 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 That was incredible. You led the shot. I let them shot. You led the shot. I led my shot. Yeah. Finally. We've come so far. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> God, that was beautiful. <laughs> Just excellent. I just needed to like lock it in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my, my gosh. god! Thank you. <laughs> I can't believe I got that. <laughs> <laughs> it was great. It was beautiful. Woo! Couldn't use it. Why not? It's hard the shit. Inside this case was disassembled. Yeah. Kaito and I learned how to assemble the crossbow from Maki, so we could have done it. But I don't believe someone without the proper training could have assembled it. Well, what if Maki taught Himiko how to assemble the crossbow? She didn't teach me that, right, Maki? Hmm? What's wrong? Are you mad about before? Sorry. I thought they were gonna suspect me. So, I lied. I really have to question your morals if you're blaming Maki for your lie, Himiko. I don't think you're allowed to say something like that. Mm. I'm sorry, Maki. Please, can you tell them the truth? Yeah, there's... Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's... Uh... Fine. I'm not going to lie. I didn't teach Himiko how to assemble the crossbow. She couldn't have used it. See? I told you! It's just like I said! <laughs> I love her voice acting. Yeah, it's, no, it's so really good. It's really good. It's really good. Everyone who suspected me needs to apologize right now! <laughs> <laughs> she changed back so fast. I think I might have whiplash now. <laughs> then... Why did you bring the crossbow to the hangar, Himiko? I was asked to. Yeah. Asked to? 
perhaps the person who asked was... Uh, I'm gonna guess it. I thought it was Kaito. Go for it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have to confirm it. That's it! Yeah. Mm-hmm. Was it... Kaito? Huh? Kaito? Only Kaito or Kokichi would have asked for a crossbow to be brought to the hangar. Because Kaito knows how to assemble the crossbow, he certainly could have used it. Knowing that, I can't imagine that anyone else would have asked Himiko. I do not think she would bring it at Kokichi's request. Of course not. Why would I ever listen to Kokichi? Because I know you like me. <laughs> <laughs> that line read was funny. Mm -hmm. Nah. <laughs> I like you. What's happening? <laughs> Himiko? Stop, don't. <laughs> hey, don't play with Himiko's heart. <laughs> bad calls, bad ba calls. Bad calls, everybody, stop. But I think that Kaito asked Himiko to do that. But to think Kaito asked Himiko to do that. Sorry. Maybe Kaito was trying to keep the promise we made yesterday. He's gonna take care of it. Don't you worry. I'll do something about all this. That's a promise. All you guys are working so hard, so I can't just sit back and relax. But why were you keeping that a secret, Himiko? Well, Kaito sort of asked me to keep it a secret. And then Kaito died and I got scared. I thought it was gonna be next. You're the worst for trying to pin the blame on Maki just for that reason. Maki, teach this dumb monkey the true terror of human beings. Don't bully the person you like. <laughs> this is Wait, Kokichi likes, likes Maki now? <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> the dynamics. Whoa. Is Kaito really dead? Kaito's still a question mark. But we did we did we saw his body get smushed. <sighs> but we also heard him talk when the Exosol showed up. I know. I know, which makes me think that maybe both him and Kokichi are dead. But Kokichi's talking right now. I don't. But it might not be Kokichi. It might be a a, a robot. Like it might be. It could be a robot. It might be, it might be a frog. Like robot. <laughs> robot. 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 Um, like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, bleh. The secret 16th student was a robot all along. Oh my god. <laughs> to be clear, there's 16 students already in this. I know. Meanwhile, Kibo's like, I'm right here. I know. <laughs> I was like, oh, a robot? <laughs> a talking guys, robot. Just, uh, honestly, sometimes it gets a little silly. <laughs> You're just so realistic, Kibo. We forget that you're a robot. Do you, though? <laughs> <laughs> because you comment on it all the time. <laughs> oh, anyway. my God. Himiko, when exactly did Kaito ask you to do this? Um, I think it was around evening yesterday. So you were Everyone also... Everyone came in the evening. Everybody yeah. went to give Kaito a little visit? Yeah. I was so nervous about fighting Kokichi, I couldn't get to sleep. So I took a walk near the hangar, and that's when Kaito called out to me. I got startled and wet myself a little, <laughs> and then he asked me to get him a crossbow. I appreciate the attention to detail, Himiko. Thank you. Thank you for sharing it all. Yes. Um, that one part was, uh, you know what? Never mind. <laughs> so if Kaito asked for a crossbow, does that mean he was going to kill Kokichi? No, he said it was to disable Kokichi. I wouldn't have helped him otherwise. I trusted Kaito and took a crossbow from Maki's lab. That's when I witnessed Himiko. Okay, okay. This is kind of what I had suspected. I had said this a little while back. I was like, okay, maybe Kaito asked Himiko to bring it mm -hmm. and then slip it into the window. But then, clearly, 
some shit happens. I mean, well, yeah, like Kokichi and things, Kaito. There, there were occurrences. There's, a, there's, there's, there's crossbow, poison, poison, antidote, crossbow. multiple crossbow bolts have been fired. Right? Yeah. There's fucking strike nine. Like, yep. Uh, oh, I guess it's poison, but uh, somebody stripped K Kokichi's clothes off. Like shoved him in the toilet. He might be in that exosol and just be naked right now. For all we know, he probably is. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's why he can't come out. He's like, he's got no clothes. It's for my modesty. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't want to make me a nude sprite, so they animated an exosol. <laughs> <laughs> I've <laughs> seen through with my ruse. We couldn't show Kokichi with his shirt off. Yeah. Therefore, we had to put him in an exosol. <laughs> it's not like this was. <laughs> it's a um, it's a like a M rated game. <laughs> yeah right. Yeah right. <laughs> it's not like there's blood everywhere yeah. at all times. We can't show Kokichi with his shirt off. No, it's too lewd. Oh my what god. Did Kaito do after Think he of the children. <laughs> I don't know. I just handed him the crossbow, then went right back to the dorm. Presumably, Kaito tried to attack Kokichi, only to be disarmed of the crossbow. And then, Kokichi returns fire and shot Kaito. That sequence of events seems logical. No, it happened a little differently. Both Kaito and Kokichi shot the crossbow. They both got shot with it. And there's proof of that. Uh, 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 three arrows, uh, maybe? Three arrows, finally? Or is it, uh, yeah, whatever. No, no, it's not. God, I'm sorry. I, I keep leading you astray to the three, three arrows. Three arrows are cursing me. Yeah, I, I, I feel like it's one of the puncture wounds, Probably. right? Probably. Kokichi's close. I didn't even read through that. Sorry. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, the are, do we want to show is Kaito's it, coat or it, do we want to show the Kokichi's clothes? It's Kokichi's clothes. Show that Kaito and. I'm gonna do this. This is it! Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Remember that when we found Kokichi's clothes, there were holes in the back and sleeve. We already know there's a hole through Kaito's. Yes. We already saw that. But we didn't really establish that there were holes in Kokichi's clothes as well. Yeah. We just said that we had found Kokichi's clothes. Well, That's we it. said there were holes, but not, we haven't gone through it. Yeah. 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 The same kind of hole that was found in Kaito's coat. Was shot by the crossbow too. Then it was Kaito who shot him, right? Mm, I'm not sure. I don't remember anything like that. You don't remember whether or not you were shot? There is no doubt that they shot each other with the crossbow, but it doesn't matter. Huh? It doesn't matter what happened in between. In the end, Kokichi killed Kaito. Maki's been acting strangely. But why? Does she know something? If so, what does she know? She's gotta know something. Maybe Maki's right. It doesn't matter what happened in the middle. But in the end, there's no mistake that Kokichi killed Kaito. <sighs> Yo! Uh! Then let's hurry up and vote. No, it's too soon. There are still mysteries. Who cares about that? We already know who the culprit is. You sure about that? Monokuma? Monokuma? Huh? Interjecting. Just wanted to, you know. Why? Just stepping in. For a moment. What? Now he's joining in? As the one running this trial, it bothers me when anyone says mysteries don't matter. Mm. It affects the overall entertainment value, so I encourage you to really think about things. After all, there should be some mysteries that still matter. For example, is Kokichi really inside that exosol? Stuff like that. Yeah, that's what I've been saying. Yeah, but you never want to have Monokuma be the one presenting your arguments. Yeah, that's very true. Shit. 
Now <laughs> everyone's gonna be like, uh, what? What? That. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is he really in there? What are you saying? We already finished that discussion a while ago. That's. I. <sighs> Kokichi's gotta still be alive since the killing game's still going. No! Oh my god! His voice is even coming from the Exosol and everything. Yeah, and so was Kaito's voice at the beginning. Come on, people. Yeah, but he's standing behind but the Kokichi picture. But we heard it speak in oh. Kaito's voice earlier, didn't we? Thank you, Monokuma. Yeah, don't rely on that. After all, this Exosol has a voice changer. Oh, great. Awesome. It, what? And we had a video camera. Oh my god. The video camera, Allison. The video camera. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. It's the the video camera. Ha. Because of that, nobody realizes I'm pretending to be Kokichi. Stop. They're both dead. They're both dead. They're both dead. Ah! But no more. Sorry for the wait, guys. Stop. Jump back on over. Other Sorry side, buddy. Sorry for the wait, guys. <laughs> Walk. The luminary of the stars has arrived. This time for real. What? What's going on? I told you, I'm Kaito. I was just pretending to be Kokichi, is all. <laughs> uh -huh. Pretending to be Kokichi, is all. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Sure. Yeah. 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 There's a bit of a situation going on, so I didn't really have a choice. Uh huh. Sorry about tricking you guys like that. My bad. My bad. So what's going on, everyone? Huh? So Kaito's in there after all? Don't be stupid. How many times are you going to be tricked by him? That's Kokichi pretending to be Kaito. Hey now, Maki Roll. Don't you believe me? Don't ever call me that. Ugh. <sighs> Whoa there, chill. You really think I'm Kokichi? I mean, I guess I understand. Sorry, I can't really get out of this thing right now. Why not? I can't move because of the injury I got from Kokichi. Uh-huh. It's so bad I can't even stand. That's why I'm in this Exosol. Uh-huh. Is that so? But if you guys don't believe me, then we can't move on. This has to be so, like, existentially mind-fucky for all of them. I'm thinking about that, too. Yeah, right? like, like as, as, as flattened against the couch as it is for us, like, oh my god. Can you imagine, like, being, like, having this happen to you right now? God. Like, I, I, my brain would break. Because hypothetically, one of these voices is that of a dead person. Right. For, At possibly least one. two. Possibly yeah. two. Like, this is really fucked up. Yeah. Like, whatever's happening right now, it's really fucked up. I yeah. Like, it's like that scene in Dear Evan Hansen where they have Connors, like, uh, do a little, like, dance and jig and stuff. It's like, yeah. Uh, it's, 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 you know. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's, yeah. it's weird. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Oh. So, you're up, Shuichi. No. Oh, God. Yeah, <laughs> it's just like, it's like, come on. Oh, this is awful. Yeah, it's pretty bad. What? Me? Explain to everyone how I wasn't the one that died. And it's and she, all- She's and like, it, I mean, that was my theory. And do you see what it is? Okay. It, it continues to be, okay, Shuichi, now do your job. Like it- it's still like even uh, even though it's it's Ka it's Kaito slash Kokichi yeah slash but Kaito ooh, question mark question mark question was mark. one of the main people to say okay Shuichi do your job early that's on true. so that's that is kind of in character yeah but his his reasoning for it was to give Shuichi confidence and to no and, I mean in the window him. oh well that too yeah oh yeah 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 He's like you you you're they're they're do big job. scene yeah yeah that's true can find the truth behind truth oh. and the truth behind lies. Oh. And we 
we can use lies to tell the truth. Yeah, and the truth that we saw will be gone if that man dies. So, you know, anyway. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> we can we can we can play the Is video that a game. Thing? No. No, okay. I'm okay. recording Midnight Channel the musical. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why I was like, what are okay, I'm like, what are you no. recording? Oh my god. All right, I'll continue. Although we're we'll we'll, we'll continue a little bit more. Let's see. Kaito is alive after all? No, maybe. That's just what I want to believe. Is it really true? What story does the evidence tell? Does this story end with Kaito or Kokichi being the victim? I need to give a well-reasoned answer to that question. And soon. I wonder if it's going to go to mid-trial. That's what I, I was wondering. I yeah. was like, if we could just get to mid-trial, that would be a decent... I can't look away from the truth. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I think we're getting there. The victim <gasps> of this case is... Stop it! No! No, 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 Who do you no, think no, it no. is, Allison? No, no, no! Who do you think no. it is, Allison? <sighs> it's, Who is it? It's both of them! Okay, but if it had to be one... I think it's Gokichi. Most of the evidence we have now shows that Kaito is the victim. I just clicked on Kokichi. Oh. Oh. Hmm. What's the matter, Shuichi? You just gotta say it with confidence. I can't look away from the truth. It's disagreeing with you. Oh, I see. <sighs> It's disagreeing with you. It's, it's, I knew, I had a feeling this was gonna happen. I'm trying, I Ugh. really am, but I can't think of anyone other than Kaito. Most of the evidence we have points to Kaito. Hey, what's the matter, Shuichi? There we go. <sighs> Just hurry up and tell everyone why I'm not dead. Should be easy. No, I won't. Because you're not Kaito. Thank you. Thank you. The point of that ch choice was that there wasn't actually a choice to be made there. We just well, needed to make a... We a chose. Leap. And and the correct answer was Kaito. I guess that... I guess, yeah. yeah the correct answer was that, that the victim is Kaito. Apparently. Well, to to the question that, that Shuichi was asking. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Kaito is already dead. Whoa! <laughs> good, good. This is already more entertaining. Now, the Ultimate Academy is proud to present its very own more phenomenal trial grounds. Okay. I think it's the head-to-head. -head. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. The scrum. Okay. But who's on? Who's on what side? Who's on the Kokichi side right now? On, on, like, the Kokichi did it side? No, Kokichi's dead side. Who would be on that side? Maybe just Kaito. Just th We're just going to go up against Exosol Kaito? Maybe. Do we want to see? Do we want to do that as the final thing? Yeah. And then let's, be done? Let's do yeah. that. Uh, let's do one final thing. What the fuck? I'm so... Oh, my God. I'm still kind of... I'm still tripped up with the with that decision-making thing there for for the victim, but... Yeah. It's okay. We can I feel I feel silly because it's like, yes, I that's what I was saying. Kaito's already dead. Mm -hmm. Kaito's already dead. Kaito's already dead. But I think Kokichi is too. It's possible. But I don't think I was supposed to make that call there yet. It's kind you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know. I, I think don't the know. question that was asked is what does the evidence point towards? The evidence okay. And the answer was Kaito. That like 98% of the evidence points towards Kaito being dead. Yes. I, or being the victim. And and yeah, so Kaito's already dead. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Let's All continue. right. Let's give it everything we've got. Okay. All right. Split opinion. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Who's on what side? I the Exosol is in fact on a little floaty thing. Is it so on a floaty thing? Yeah, it's on a floaty thing. No, it, no, it's just sitting there. 
Well, it's, it's got a little pad underneath it. Oh. I really wanted it to come up and float with us. What? Interesting. It's Kokichi? It's Kaito. Okay. I suspect that Kaito is inside the Exosol. Uh, he said that he can't shit. Leave the it's probably Exosol. Injured. Oh, injury. injury. Well, there's no point. Kaito's yeah, I should just... Claim. I'm gonna read them yeah. all. Is it possible that Kokichi got crushed instead of... Mark. Yeah. Did you watch the footage? Kaito was the one who got crushed. But there was an arrow hole on... I got this! Kaito's <laughs> clothes had arrow holes, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have to believe Kaito is still alive and defeated the mastermind. I got this! Because the evidence doesn't support the claim that Kaito is still alive. Why are yeah. you so opposed to Kaito oh. being alive? That was the wrong I got one. This. Because the evidence doesn't support the claim that Kaito is still alive. Yeah, the mastermind was the last one. Mastermind. I suspect okay. that Kaito is inside the Exosol. Okay. okay. Alright, I'm just gonna start over. Yep. Okay, the first one. I suspect dead. that Kaito is inside the Exosol. Uh, I got Exosol. this. Yeah. Unless he comes out of the Exosol, we can't confirm that. Uh, right? Yeah. He said that he can't leave the Exosol because he's injured. Injury. Where's injury? Mother. There it is. Anyone who knows about Kaito's injury can make that claim. Okay, okay, okay. Is it possible that crushed. Kokichi got crushed instead of Kaito? Yeah. Did you watch the footage? Kaito was the one who got crushed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There arrow holes. Arrow holes. I got this. Yeah, Kaito's that one. clothes had arrow holes too. And that's Mastermind. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I want to believe Kaito. Yeah. yeah. The Mastermind is still alive, inside that Exosol. Why <sighs> are you so? I got this. Because yeah, the gotta evidence gotta doesn't like, support. Be 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 be. I got yep, yep, yep. in a sec. I'm ready. Which one? A Y X B. There you go. Silly. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, um, well, uh, huh? Want to believe it? In a way, I still can't. But the evidence, the evidence shows that Kaito must be the one who died. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Yeah, and I feel like we might have to continue this line of discussion next time. I think you're absolutely uh, right. But yeah, it's true. The evidence that we have so far points to Kaito being dead. He's dead. But is he? <laughs> Stop it! it! No! Oh! I don't know. I mean, I mean, I do, but <laughs> if we're going, if we're going to be like really, really specific here, the evidence shows that Kaito must be the one who died. According to the evidence, he's he he's dead and was already dead before he got crushed in the in the press. <sighs> So we needed to come to that. I, I basically what I was saying earlier is that we needed to come to this conclusion right now that Kaito is dead in order to proceed. And I think in proceeding, I suspect that we will discover that Kokichi is also already dead or currently dead, I think. Mm -hmm. And then it's going to be like, well, if the mastermind is dead, then why is the killing game still going? And then we have to figure out why the killing game is still going. Do you have a theory? Of who? Of why the killing game is still going? Yeah. No, I don't. Okay. I have no idea. Cool stuff. Just, just want to do a quick check in on that. That's I all. Have <laughs> no clue except maybe Samugi wants to kill everyone. I don't know <laughs> because that's my funny little bit. That's all I got. <laughs> it has been from day one. Like, you are correct. <laughs> But that's nothing. She came out the prologue under <laughs> under suspicion. Jeez. It's yeah. just like so far it's just been here. Like, I don't know. <laughs> uh, we should have hung, hung out with her or Himiko more. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But that's my theory is that. Yes, Kaito's dead. But we're going to, we're going to, that Exosol, like, cockpit door is going to open up and there's going to be nobody inside. And everyone's going to be like, what the fuck? And then we have to figure out where Kokichi's body is. If it is. 
somewhere, you know? Like, I, I... Maybe they were just laid exactly on top of each other. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> he was laying on top of his jacket. So maybe from that angle, I don't know. He We could have... There's Koki a corpse under there. Kokichi's very small. Could have stuck him underneath. I... I... <laughs> I I don't know. I don't know. And then that's the other thing too. I'm sorry. I know we were about to end this episode. No, but no, no, no. I, I asked. I, I'm. This is what I. This is what I wanted. Yeah. <laughs> if if they're both dead, if they're both dead, and we thought that Kokichi was the one that killed Kaito, um, but they're both dead, then it's like, then why are we having this tr class trial? And like I said, and like Shuichi has suggested, it's possible that someone in our group right now is actually the blackened so hmm? and 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 i think i think maybe that you know maybe there was this plan to try and take out kokichi because there's an interpretation that kokichi was the mastermind so therefore if we take out kokichi then the game is over you know it's mm -hmm. like a it's a fun it's a fun little callback a little bit to the first chapter Kokichi even called it out. He's like, well, you know, if if Kaede was was right and had killed me instead of Rantaro, then the game would have been over. Ha <laughs> ha. Like, mm -hmm. so someone could have, like, super internalized that and plotted with Kaito to take him down. Um, so even if Kaito died along the way, maybe it was, like unintentional you know like he wasn't actually like the victim like he was just a casualty he's of, a casualty encounter yes okay. exactly um and that maybe it was kaito plus somebody else in the group to try and take down kokichi and they succeeded but kaito is dead and now that person is here and the blackened and maybe it is maki could I be i don't know i do maybe. think that that idea is interesting just because we have five putting aside uh kaito and kokichi right now just yeah because we're we're taking them out if uh, assuming you're you, what you just said is correct we have five remaining people and then one of them would be the black end and then one of them would be one of like i don't know so that's just a very small cast <gasps> yes to work with yes it's really small and it feels so uh i don't know hopeless Yep. Feels really hopeless. Yep. Which interesting. <laughs> <laughs> and interesting with that, turn of phrase you've chosen. And with that, <laughs> I think we gotta end it. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. We will see you next time, folks, as we continue this class trial. Oh. Mm -hmm. Bye, everyone. Yes. 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 <laughs>